Alright, what is going on guys? This is SSN Santa here coming into the brand new video and today we're going to be taking a look at the best class setup for the FAMAS in Bullet Force guys. If any of you are new to my channel, welcome, but let's get right into it. So starting off with the attachments, we're going to be using the Coyote site today. Um, one of my favorite red dot sites to be honest in the game because when you're up close you can actually see your targets more easily. It's a lot more open than the standard RDS site and um, I do like using this for the FAMAS. Now for the second attachment we're going to be using is the Muzzle Break and as you guys know this will reduce your recoil. Um, which is really nice to have for any kind of gun to be honest with you guys and um, especially in the FAMAS it has a very fast fire rate so it does help you to kick down on that recoil just a bit and be a little bit more accurate with your shots now next guys for the secondary we're going to be using the Desert Eagle today um, as you guys know this is one of my favorite secondaries I use with most of my class setups and the main reasons are is because this thing has insanely good range very good damage and a very fast fire rate as well um, one of the best things about it for the FAMAS class up today is that you can be at a safe distance when you're taking out kills at far range that you wouldn't normally be able to take out with the FAMAS and I do really like that you know it allows your team to push forward as you get a ton more kills on the enemy spawn or wherever you're shooting and it's definitely really overpowered to use with the FAMAS now for the kill streaks today guys we're gonna be using the UAV of course that way after you get four kills you can easily see where people are spawning and try to get as many kills as you can there where you can set Secondly, get the Super Soldier um, kill streak as well, and this kill streak is one of my favorites, guys, that I've been using recently because you get 30 seconds of insanely good damage. Um, your bullets turn blue, and it just helps you go on a better kill streak, you know. Because what you're doing is you get up to the 13 kills, you finally turn Super Soldier on, and then you go into beast mode. You're just taking out kills left and right, and it's super overpowered. I really like using that. And finally, guys, of course, the nuke. Just in case you get to 25 kills, that way you can drop that on the lobby, get all the kills, and it just looks super dope, guys. Now for the throwable today. We're going to be using the smoke grenade guys and you guys know how I like to use this So basically what I'll use it for is I'll use it as a decoy or I'll use it as a like protection between two spawns or whatever I'm gonna do usually if I get a ton of kills what I'll do is I'll throw it in the same spot that I was at so that way I attract the enemy team because they're gonna want to come and kill me they're gonna be like okay he just took out five kills on the spawn we have to go and get them they'll see the smoke grenade in the exact location where I am where most of my teammates are gonna be and then that gives me time to go around at a different angle take out more kills and then possibly use another smoke grenade to do the same exact tactic and take the rest of the kills out at my previous spot and it's super overpowered guys I really love using the, the smokes that way all right now we're gonna move over to the perks guys um, the four main perks that I really like to use with this gun is firstly gonna be optimized guys of course you want to have a faster reload speed especially with the FAMAS it's a little bit slow um, so basically what I like to use is use optimize that way I get the magazine into the gun as fast as possible especially since it's a submachine gun you're up close you don't want to be wasting a couple seconds around a corner trying to reload not being able to and then only having your final resort to the desert eagle definitely um, helps to have optimized guys now secondly what I like to run is gonna be extended guys extended is gonna give you a couple extra bullets in the mag I just always love the idea of having more bullets more ammo guys that could be more kills um, it could save your life guys sometimes I notice that I'll be at the end of the magazine and I'm about to take in a kill and I run out of bullets and I only needed like one or two more so extended can definitely save your life guys and save those kill streaks for you later on in the game now next we're also gonna be using super strife of course guys one of my next favorite perks um, that allows you to move side to side a lot quicker while aiming down sight guys so basically if you're hip firing if you're aiming down sights you're gonna have a fluid movement um, throughout the map going between kills um, it's gonna be a lot harder to shoot you um, usually if you don't use super strife you're basically a sitting duck guys it's a lot harder to move and it doesn't feel natural and then the final perk we're gonna be using today guys is gonna be trigger finger of course trigger finger is one of the best one slot perk especially when you have a very nice secondary like the desert eagle that you want to make fully automatic guys it definitely helps you out rather than tap firing sometimes your accuracy is a little bit off but with this you can basically just switch over in the heat of the moment take out a couple kills and it's just really fun to use but overall guys I think this is the best class setup for the FAMAS in Bullet Force guys if you did enjoy this video definitely drop a like comment down below any questions you have for me and if you're new to my channel guys subscribe and I will see you all in the next one peace out